This week we'll be talking with Heather Golnick, who comes from Colorado Springs. She's going to be talking to us about staying fit at a later age and avoiding injury. Hey Spartans, this is Kevin Gelati and welcome to the Spartan Athlete. Heather, you and I have a pretty long history with multi-sports. We both switched over to OCR racing. We're both in our 40s. Tell me, what do you have to go through? What kind of strategies you, do you use at your age to stay this fit, this awesome, and keep going after 30 plus years of racing? I, like you, just am addicted to working out and sport and just love the competition. And I think when you love competition, it drives you to train. Yes. How are you at this age keeping from getting injured? Well, I definitely think as you get older, we're both 48, yeah. um, as you get older, you also get smarter. And so sometimes I have aches and pains and I just, I listen more. And I think when I was younger, I never would stop. Um, yeah. And I think I'm just very, very fortunate too. I do a lot of cross training. The triathlon background helps with that. I do a lot of strength training. Uh, I do a lot of recovery do modalities. Do you think there's a genetic component there to us? Uh, yeah. Probably some of that, for sure. You know, I think obviously just the consistent training, you know, it's consistent over years and years and years, um, plays a part in it. I think sometimes people come into the sport new and they try to do that same amount of training and their yeah. body's not ready for it. Yeah. Give me some idea about what you do for nutrition, especially at our age. The most important thing, you know, they say, recovery drinks within 30 minutes. For me, it's like five minutes. Like yeah. I make it before I go out to run. I make it before I go bike or run. You know, it's made and so you when already I come have in, it, I'm drinking it. You know, I went for a little run today. I had it right when I was done, so. So when it comes to those recovery type protocols, you're not lagging behind and delaying on it, thinking, oh, I'll get to it at some point. You're getting to it immediately to start to get that body to heal quickly so you can perform well again the next day. Definitely. Yeah, same strategy I use. Well, hey, I'm glad to see you here. I know you're going to crush it because you always crush it. Have a great race. Thanks, Cap. All right. Thanks for listening to the Spartan Athlete, the Friday edition of the Spartan Up podcast. Be sure to tune in next Friday where I talk to more athletes. We talk about racing, strategies, preparation, and getting you ready for a Spartan race. So get involved, subscribe, leave a comment, list on your favorite platform, and we'll see you next Friday.